Hello friends, welcome to a new tutorial. If you want to know how we can create light function and light flicker effects inside Unreal Engine 5.4, stay with me for the rest of the tutorial. Before we start, if you're interested in this content, give us a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and join our newsletter for exclusive educational tips and updates. Stay tuned for more exciting videos. To create the light function effect, I place two rect light sources in the scene. I select the light in the content drawer section. I create a new material. In the material settings section, I set the material domain mode to light function and add the black and white alpha texture that I have prepared to the material. I add the multiply node by pressing M and left clicking. I connect the texture to input A. Right click on input B and select promote to parameter. For the parameter, I set the name as intensity and set the default number to 1. Connect the multiply node to emissive color. By clicking on apply and save, I save the material. Right click on the parent material and create a material instance. Assign the material instance from the light function section to light function material. To change the dimensions of the alpha texture, enter the parent material. Combine texture node coordinate with multiply node. Right click on input B and select promote to parameter. Name this parameter tile and set the default number to 2. Connect multiply node to the UVS input of the texture and then save the material. Also, by changing the values of light function scale, I change the dimensions of the texture and its impact on the scene. I can do these steps for the other lights as well and create new shadows. Take a duplicate of the material instance. From the global texture parameter section, I change the albedo texture. Apply the new material to the second light. By changing the values of light function scale, I change the dimensions of the texture and its impact on the scene. To create a light flicker effect, I used a spotlight source and a rect light source in the scene. I select the desired light in the content drawer section, create a new material. I set the material mode to light function, add a time node and connect it to input A of multiply node. Right click on input B and select promote to parameter. Name this parameter speed and set its default number to one. Connect multiply node to sine node, connect sine node to frac node and connect frac node to emissive color. I save the material. From the parent material, I create a material instance. Assign the material instance to the selected lights light function material. Repeat these steps for other light as well. I take a duplicate of the material instance, change the speed value, save the material and apply it to the second lights light function material. This effect is created beautifully for us. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time.